iOS 26 is finally here and it brings a ton of new features and changes and of course an all new liquid glass design. And of course it brings also new customization features and now you can customize your iOS device more than ever before. So in today's video I will show you guys a few different ideas which you can use to create a custom setup on the home screen of your new iOS 26 device. Now before we get into all that I just want to ask you guys for a really quick favor. Most of you guys that watch my videos are currently not subscribed to the channel so if you're enjoying the videos and you want to see more of them please make sure you hit that subscribe button it really helps out a lot. Now I know we're talking about home screen here but let's first just quickly talk about the lock screen. And as you probably know by now you can get this big clock on the lock screen of your device and what I suggest you do is use these wallpapers that do offer the depth effect and they look absolutely stunning. You can see how cool these look right here. I have a ton of them and I have a couple of apps from where you can get these wallpapers. I will leave them linked right down below in the description of the video. But while setting up your device make sure that you use the wallpaper with a depth effect on the lock screen. It looks absolutely amazing. And now let's move on to the home screen and these are a few ideas that you can use a few different setups that you can create. First of all this one with this colorful wallpaper. Now of course the main thing here will be the way you customize the icons and the wallpaper that you're using. This one is absolutely amazing. Now what we have done here just simply apply this wallpaper. Of course the wallpaper will be linked right down below in the description of the video if you just want to recreate the exact same setup. But what we have used here is the wallpaper and of course the clear icons. They are really really cool. Now you can can see right here is actually kind of hard to see the icons but they look cool so you have to deal with that. So tap the edit button right here go to customize and you will have the clear option. Now what you can do here is enable or disable the tint in the wallpaper not by enabling it you can see you can see the icons a bit more clear and I also have used the big icons which makes the screen look much cleaner by removing the labels from the icons but if you feel like that's too much and you're not able to actually see the icons quite well then you can just go ahead and also enable the labels here. They still look cool and you have the labels and you know what icon is what but you can see the glass effect right there it looks much better with the bigger icons you can see the glass effect more here so if we go ahead and just move back to the bigger icons and you can see right here the widget as well the liquid glass effect it just looks absolutely amazing with this colorful wallpaper so again pretty simple to create all you have to do is just place on your home screen a colorful wallpaper enable the clear icons and it looks absolutely amazing. The next thing you can do is actually use a split wallpaper. Now just go ahead and search for split wallpapers on the Google and you will be able to find something like this. It is actually a really cool way to change the look of the home screen on your device. You can see how cool this looks. So all we have done here is applied this wallpaper and then just tint the icons. It is really simple. Now what we have done here is tap the edit button. Now I have used here three different widgets and then I have three icons here on the right side. Of course you can use whatever you want. You might want to place icons here and widgets in the other side. You can configure them any way you like but then all you have to do is go to edit, go to customize right here and just pick this right here and pick one of the colors of the wallpaper on this side and then use that color to actually tint the icons. Now you can make the wallpaper brighter by just choosing it there and as you can see right here we can have the smaller or the bigger icons. The bigger ones look better and then you can also adjust the tint with this slider right here. And as you can see you get a really nice looking setup on your home screen by having everything matching here and having like the widgets on this side which actually look transparent as you can see. It will basically just show Show you the highlights around the widgets which actually look really really nice and the colorful tint right there. Now of course you can also use other colors for the tint if you don't want to use any of the wallpaper colors you can just simply slide here and just find any color that you think it suits better or it looks better with your wallpaper and have this amazing setup on your home screen. 
Now here is the next one and this one is really cool as well. So as you can see right here, we have a solid color in the background and what you will see here are the icons, the labels, they are now black, not white. They look really amazing. And as you can see, we have the icons in white here and then just we have that like shine around the icons, that reflection effect that also moves as you move your iPhone. It looks actually really, really awesome. Now to create this, you don't actually need to use anything no wallpaper or nothing all you have to do is just go ahead and edit the home screen wallpaper whatever wallpaper you have now with ios 26 that's actually really easy to do you can actually do that directly from here don't have to go through the lock screen to do it you just go to the edit mode and go to edit wallpaper now all you have to do here is just tap on color and just go ahead and pick a color that you like once you have picked that color then go back to the home screen and then go to customize tap the edit button go to customize and here just choose the clear option now you will have this button that will be enabled automatically once you choose the clear button so make sure you have this disabled so we have a lighter wallpaper and then of course you can choose whether you want to have the labels or not and as you can see right here get a really really clean looking home screen on your device just the icons with the shine around them and they look absolutely stunning and last but not least will be something like this a wallpaper usually i suggest that you have a wallpaper that has like two main colors like on this one we have black and yellow and then you can also tint the icons to match the wallpaper and you will get a simple but very clean looking setup on your home screen like this one right here it is very simple to recreate you just like apply this wallpaper or any other wallpaper you might like again the the trick here is to have a wallpaper that has one main color and a second color like you can see right here most of it is yellow and a few like black things right here so we tap the edit button pretty simple go to customize and just choose the tint color now you can see with ios 26 we have this button that chooses the color from the wallpaper so the main color of the wallpaper will be the one to which the icons will be tinted or you can go ahead and pick the color with this color picker right here which is basically the same color here but it is actually really cool and it looks like very nice and clean i can see you can change the colors here but it doesn't look as good as with this one now you can choose between dark and also light if you go with light you will have more transparent looking like you can see right here the icons are way more transparent let's go to customize and turn off the tint and if you want to go with a dark one it will add the dark tint right there in my opinion this looks much much better and it suits better the wallpaper making your home screen look really really nice so that is it for this video guys these are a few different ideas in which you can use to actually customize your home screen on the new ios 26 ios 26 is here with a ton of new features and changes and a lot of different ways to customize your device and make it look really really unique so that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed the video and found it helpful if you did smash that like button and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys on the next one